Shalom, friends. If you believe the words of Yeshua are right and truth, stay tuned. If you believe that Yeshua knew the future from the beginning, stay tuned. If you believe that Yeshua was speaking to the last generation, our generation, when he gave John revelation, stay tuned. If you believe that Yeshua is the way, the truth, and the life, and that no one comes to the Father except through him, and that he is gathering his sheep out of this evil world, stay tuned. Because Yeshua has something to say to you. In Revelation 2, verse 6, Yeshua is talking to the angel of the church of Ephesus, and he says, But this you have, that you hate the deeds of the Nicolaitans, which I also hate. Strong words for our Messiah. And then again, in Revelation 2, verse 15, he's speaking to the angel of the church in Pergamos and says, Thus you also have those who hold the doctrine of the Nicolaitan, which thing I hate. And Pergamos is where the throne of Satan is, which I will be in Rome. At this point, if you're not already convinced who the Nicolaitans are, and I believe we're supposed to know who they are, uh, now would be a great time to do some diligent studying and praying because I believe that Yeshua will give the answer to those who are seeking the answer. It's not something that he would withhold from us. He wants us to know this stuff. So, uh, if you're open to a suggestion, let's look at the word Nicolaitans. It's kind of like uh, Catholics. A person who is a Catholic will do the deeds of a Catholic and will follow the Catholic faith. It stands to reason that Nicolaitans will, f will follow or participate in the deeds of a Nicholas. Do we know of any Nicholas that has a huge worldwide, world known following? Has anyone here ever done a word search on Google for Old Nick? Old Nick in American English, noun, informal, the devil, Satan. Let's go to the actual entry. Old Nick, definition of Old Nick, which is, of course, short for Nicholas. The devil, Satan, word, origin, is water sprite, goblin, sprite. That, <laughs> that makes me never want to drink another sprite in my life, even though I don't drink those kind of drinks anyway anymore. All right, uh, informal, devil, Satan again. Just keeps on saying the same thing, but in British, an informal, a jocular name for Satan. So, Nicolaitans, are, are those people who follow Satan? And do they have a big holiday at the winter solstice when the sun is starting to come back it's something to think about and Yeshua hates Nicolaitans look at images of old Nick well Thought I'd just kind of go down just to kind of see. But let's look at images. 
I don't know who that guy is. But if we look at images of old Nick, we see uh, the devil. I didn't know there was a an alcohol for it. I mean, this stuff doesn't look very Christian. Old Saint Nick. Now, if you put Saint in front of the devil's name, does that make him good? Uh, <laughs> I don't think I even have to answer that. But there is a group of people who consider themselves Christian who put Saint in front of just about everything. And they think that if the word saint is in front of something, then it's okay. If you had been Yeshua 2,000 years ago, and you were gathering your sheep together for the kingdom, and you knew what was going to happen 2,000 years later, and the things that people would care about, how would you go about warning the people 2,000 years later about the evil that was going to be on the earth? That they should not be celebrating the death of Christ. Christ Mass. Mass is a celebration of death. I mean, he warns us not to do the deeds of the Nicolaitans, those who follow Saint, quote, Nicholas. Well, this is just a warning for the people who love Yeshua and who want to follow only him and to love the things that he loves and to hate the things that he hates because he does hate, he says it himself. If nothing else, may this video uh, spur you to do a diligent search on your own and look at the origins of Christmas and uh, prayerfully consider if it's something you want to be participating in or not. Yahweh gives us holidays that we should do. So, anyway, shalom. Love you guys.